at Burke Lake. We're here on Muskie Hunt number three. So today I'm being joined by Mike Shao, AKA One Rod One Reel. He's on his way here right now. I just wanted to give you guys a quick story as to why I'm even doing this muskie hunt. So back in the day when Ace and I were learning to fish, we really did most of it at Lake Gaston when we were there on the weekends. But as we got older, we had that itch we just couldn't scratch and we just really wanted to fish more. So Burke Lake was one of the places that I found online. And when I was looking at the species list, I saw a muskie. And I looked this fish up and I was just in awe. I was, thought it was the coolest looking fish. They're huge, they have huge teeth. They're just something different from bass. And Burke Lake was one of the closest places that had them. So ever since I was probably 13 or 14 years old, I've always wanted to catch one. And now I want to catch one from Burke Lake specifically just because of the nostalgia of it. I mean, I remember being a young kid and thinking like, what would I even do if I hooked into one of these fish? It would just be wild. So I wanted to let you guys kind of know that and that's why I'm fishing for them here specifically and that's why I want to catch one so bad. But other than that, I had one of our subs actually send me some custom handmade baits and I cannot thank you enough for this, Martin. It is, I, I, I'm speechless to be honest with you. I really am. Um, so he sent me, first he sent me this fluoro leader. So everyone that has been telling me I need to throw either a steel leader or a fluoro leader, he hooked me up with that. So there's that and then he has two hand poured swim baits, which are sick. I can't wait to throw these. I mean, they're just awesome. So, so, so cool. They have a really cool swim bait rig on there. And then besides those, he sent me these three double eight rigs. I also really like how he put Sankos on the hooks to keep them covered, which I think is hilarious. So let's get ready. Let's get out here on the water. Mike's showing up right now. Let's do this. Let's catch a muskie today. I'm feeling so good about it. Very high spirits. Feeling great. Let's go. Fishing with a professional muskie fisherman today. <laughs> That's definitely not me. There he is. He's a pro. <laughs> I'm caught him out of a little puddle, dude, not a lake. <laughs> well, he's gonna be good luck. I'm feeling it. We're gonna catch a muskie today. Gonna be looking for some big schools of bait, target that for a while, try some main lake points, and then some flats, and then there's a hump over here that I'm gonna try as well. So, let's start the day off right. All right. Gonna give this double eight. Double eight. Looks cool. I've never ever used an inline spinner like that. Yeah. A lot of stuff. I tried to swim bait for a little bit. See that on the bottom? That's bait. That's not the bottom. <laughs> oh, that's not oh, that's, yeah, yeah. that's bait on the bottom. That's crazy. They're really hugging the bottom today. Usually they're suspended a little bit more. Did you? Yeah. yeah. So much stuff going on down there. That's a lot of stuff going on. You ever done day rig too much today, dude? I know, I'm too excited about these other baits. <laughs> All right, so we've made it one trip around the Burke Lake racetrack. No bites, and I've been mainly throwing that double eight rig, the Alabama rig, and the swim bait that Martin sent me. I'm gonna switch up the double eight rig to one of the ones with the fluorescent blades. I'm probably gonna go with this crazy orange one right here. I'm gonna throw this on. I'm gonna continue to throw the swim bait in the Alabama rig a little bit. Hopefully we'll be getting a bite today. We might run into some bass as well. It's snowing. I don't know if you guys can tell. Yeah, it's kind of light right now, but it's been snowing on and off all morning. Forecast was not calling for that. It was supposed to be sunny in 55, but Mike brought the snow. What do you think? How are you feeling about this? Hey, with no bites yet, it's gonna happen though by the end of today. We're gonna make it happen. I think we're gonna make it happen. We're feeling good. Positivity's in the boat. Just gotta bring the fish. It's gonna, I knew it was gonna be tough. It's never, it's a hunt, man. It's a hunt. Like how many have we passed already? <laughs> how many have we put our baits in front of? Oh! oh. 
Dude, that one? I just no. Am I hit? Yeah. Dang, dude. What? Was it a big hit? Yeah, that was crazy. He just stopped it. Get back in. Maybe he's still following it. Following it? No, I don't know. That was that was wild. My drag slipped. Oh, dude, that's on the double spinner too that your buddy made. Yeah. Your sub made. Wow, that's crazy, dude. That had to be a musky bite in that thing. All right, so I just got my first bite on this double eight rig. That was pretty wild. I don't even know what to. I don't know what to think. All right, I'm gonna switch it up. Go from this double eight to the one with the orange blades. This one's a little bit lighter, and the blades should give it a little bit different color. <laughs> that is bright. Look at that. Man, that looks cool. Maybe that'll be the one. Oh, there's that eagle. Oh yeah, is that the same one or a different one? I don't know, it looks, it looks smaller. Yeah. Oh, oh, dude, no. What I don't. I, no, 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 it's on there. I just like either ran into a school of shad or uh, something just snapped at it. I just like, <laughs> it just loaded up with weight. Oh. Well, there's a, there's a leaf. I'm just, <laughs> I got excited. Yeah. Oh yeah. About got about an hour. Yeah. We'll spend the rest of the day fishing this point, that point, and then the bait in the middle. Hopefully he'll show his face. Hopefully. Mr. Ski, where you at though? I just want a picture. I'll put you back. All of that is bait. Yep. We're gonna throw the marker down and spend the next hour and a half fishing that until the musky bites. I mean, with that much bait, there has to be a musky around somewhere, right? Yeah. Or at least a giant bass. Or a giant bass, yeah. Come on in here, A rig. We're gonna take the big swim bait for a stroll through all that bait down there. This big thing. Freaking huge. Musky bait. Ooh ha ha. I don't know what that was, but. Dude, what the heck? Is that a fish? That was a fish, 100%. Oh my gosh. Actually, musky are known for surfacing, but I don't know if they surface in the water this freaking cold. I don't know what else it could have been. Yeah, I don't know what else could have been either. Maybe a bass? No, a bass won't do it in 40 degree water. It's very rare. I that know that. that. That had to have been a musky. Dude, that's crazy. That is pretty crazy. Dude, that was something very big. Yeah, that was, that was a big old fish. The muskies are teasing us. Yeah, they're teasing us, all right. <laughs> what a tease. You got one? Did I hook something? You got one? I don't know, dude. I think you got one. I did. You got one. I did. Dude. There you go. He he actually bit it, too. <laughs> we didn't get skunked. We didn't get skunked. Get him out there. This is it. Go catch our muskie. This is it, guys. We have 15 minutes left to fish. Dude, he did. Oh. Oh, that's Ooh. perfect. Oh, it's, all right, he's injured. That's musky candy. Right it's there. Musky that's candy. dessert. I'm just gonna lightly lob back here. Just the lob. All right, there it goes. Free line it. Now we wait. So we got about 10 minutes left to fish. Mike's live lining a gizzard shad that we just caught. I'm still chucking this double eight rig. I've been throwing the swim bait in the Alabama rig. No luck. No bass today. No walleye. It's been tough to say the least, but. Of course, as soon as we're about to get off the water, the sun's coming out. We've literally fished through sleet, snow, <laughs> cold, like under 40 degree temperatures, and now the sun's gonna come out. So, kind of just how the day's going. But better than not being on the water. So, hopefully, these last 10 minutes will turn the day around. Mike's gonna catch a giant on that gizzard chat. It's gonna happen? It's gonna happen. Maybe I can catch a muskie on my last cast. <laughs> last cast muskie. Last cast muskie. Muskie hunt number three is coming to a close. One bite today. Missed it, unfortunately. Mike didn't have any bites. He did catch that shad though, so luckily we kept the skunk out of the boat. Yeah, still on the hunt for these muskie. 
This one is not putting me down. I'm not thinking it's going to be easy anytime. So I'm going to still get out probably another time this week at least come out here and try to catch one. And then every week until I do. Hey, appreciate it, man. Toughing it out. you as much as I can. Hopefully, once you uh, get number one. Hell yeah. We're going to do it. We're going to do it this season. This is the season for the month. So. <laughs> Fun day. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you soon.